Hello friends, welcome to awesome civil engineering channel. Today we are going to discuss about the classification and the types of dam based on different criteria. First of all, the dam is classified as material of the construction based on the function, based on head, based on hydraulic design. First of all, we are going to discuss about classification based on construction. On the basis of construction, first of all, the concrete dams, concrete dams, dam body is filled by cement concrete. And also, now, concrete dam are classified into three types. One, gravity dam, arch dam, boat race dam. First of all, now, gravity dam, gravity dam, this dam requires a strong rock foundation. This also resists the water pressure and other pressure due to its masses. Stability of the dam due to its weight and gravitational forces. Upstream surface is vertical. Downstream surface is sloping. Gravity dam has the triangular cross section. This type of gravitational this type of gravity dam is suitable for George with very steep slopes. Now number B, arch dam. Arch dam are curve in plan with convex towards the upstream of the river. Water pressure and other pressure, water pressure and other pressure forces are transferred on the abutments or valley side by the arch action. Suitable, this dam is suitable for narrow jaws or canoes with a strong abutments and can resist thrust by arch action. Now, number C, boat race dam. Boat race dam consists of water retaining slope member, slab or deck on the upstream, which is supported by series of boat race. Here you can see in the diagram. The upstream is constructed with slab or deck and it is supported by number of series of boat race. Series of boat race. Number two, embankment dams. It is also classified into three groups. F number one, earth fill or earthen embankment dam. Rock fill dam. Combined earth and rock fill dam. Now here, earth fill dam. Earth fill dam are constructed by the selection selection of selected soil only. Here, the diameter of the soil is always greater than 0 0.001, greater and equals to 0 0.001 mm and less and equals to 100 mm. And this earthen dam is compacted into the thin layers of 20 to 60 centimeter also earth fill dam can be made in three ways number one homogeneous homogeneous method zoned method and diaphragm method in homogeneous method whole body of the dam is made up of same type of earth we cannot mix here different type of soil for the construction zone type non-homogeneous different kinds of earth are mixed in figure you can see that if the dam has number of layers then first layer then the first layer is of one soil that is zone one and on other is of different different soil which is z2 zone 2 and this third layer can be used of different soil that is z3 now diaphragm in diaphragm we can insert the thin layer of impervious, impervious layer which prevent the leakage of water through the dam which resist the leakage of water from it now rock fill dam in this dam coarse grained gravels crossed rock or boulder of more than 50 percent of the total volume are kept to construct the rock fill dams rock fill dams is 
composed of 50, more than 50 percent of rocks that's why it is called as rock fill dams impervious core of compacted earth fill or bitumen member is placed at the center of the upstream here you can see in the figure if the dam is constructed if the dam is constructed and in between or in between or in center the impervious medium is kept which resists the water seepage from upstream to downstream now a steel dam this type of dam is made up of a steel framework with steel plate on the upstream these are used as temporary coffer dams for number number four timber dam these dam are made up of timber framework of timber struts and beams with the timber plank facing on the upstream to resist the water pressure on the dam now classification of dam based on the function number first a storage dam this type of dam is this type of dam store water during the large supply in the river diversion dam a small dam used to raise the water level in the river for diverting water to to off taking canal or to pass the water to the canal detention dam dam is constructed to store water during the flood and release it gradually at a safe rate this type of dam help to control or lower the large flood peak during high flood level coffer dam coffer dam is a temporary dam constructed at the upstream or downstream of the main dam to keep to keep the working area dry for the main dam it helps to divert the water from upstream or downstream away from the main dam and helps to keep the working place of main dam dry classification of dam based on head if the head of water is less than 15 meter then the dam is low head if height is less than if the height is greater than 15 meter and less than 50 meter than medium head high head dam if the height is greater than 50 meter and less than 250 meter very high head the height is greater than 250 meter classification based on hydraulic design this dam is designed by the hydraulic properties of the river like discharge in the river velocity of flow past or velocity of the flow in the river underground water aspects base of the foundation base of the foundation by keeping these category by keeping these things in mind the hydraulic design is done thanks for watching please do like subscribe and comment to the channel